Hello. On this occasion, I would like to share the relationship I have cultivated with my favorite object and how the object placement of four orders by Professor Buchanan reframed my perception of that object. I will talk about a mirrorless camera I have been fancying for the last five years. Further, the particular features that brought me improvement to me. Finally, I will explain how its value has shaped me and created my persona as a human being. I hope you enjoy the photo compilation. In my whole life, one thing I'm sure about is traveling. Or maybe I can self-proclaim that I live to travel. I am not a professional photographer and not considered myself as a photography enthusiast to some extent. I'm not the passionate to learn about composition, ISO, aperture, and so on. I'm more a person who records my life through the lens into a frame. The creative process will begin with the problem is identified according to Sean stated about problem framing. A problem emerge when the digital SLR camera has always become an essential element for our family trips. Taking a picture was not as easy as an analog and digital camera anymore. Right when we finish configuring each setting or plug the flashlight, the tour guide called us to leave or the, sp or the spot has suddenly filled with a new group of tourists. The pain becomes happier when we have to carry the camera, flashlight, or another lens inside the bag. The search for information seen as a facilitating tool to move between problem and solution space, said Doors and Cross. I experienced long communication between understanding the problem and my expectation before finally come to the solution. It was not the first time I met the EOS mirrorless series and introduced first to EOS M2 at Big Camera in Japan. However, the impression was not that intense. It didn't lead me into purchasing stage. As time goes by, I kept my eyes on the next generation of Canon mirrorless, then I met the M3. It was quite a long observation process. Now, allow me to introduce my one and only mirrorless camera, Canon EOS M3. We have been together since 2015. I bought M3 in Tokyo and of course on the occasion of traveling. Professor Buchanan's explanation of four orders of design describe how each order is interconnected. All orders integrated until they eventually create a physical or immaterial outcome. The combination of visual, industrial, and service design of Canon EOS M3 finally complement the fourth order of design. The integration of those three orders enables the sort of human interaction in the particular community and environment. The entry also accommodates me as a social animal to upload a high-resolution picture straight away after being shot. Canon powered the entry with NFC and Wi-Fi connection to provide the user easiness when tra transferring data inst instantly to mobile phone or laptop anywhere, anytime. In this case, the distribution of my photos is not only reach the closest circle, but broaden to a particular community and culture. I confidently confirm that M3 is a one-stop solution to all my pain points as a user. This is my dad. He was preparing the camera. I took some success shot and some fail shot by using my dad's camera. For a couple of years, 
My dad always brings his Canon EOS 5D Mark II with Canon EF 24 to 70 mm with 2.8 aperture L2 ultrasonic motor. I must admit, this is a beast compared to my EOS M3. The whole appearance of his camera create a capable and dependable image of my father. On the other hand, the Canon EOS 5D Mark II has successfully developed my presence as someone who excels in photography and an idealist who thrives to capture a fantastic shot. Whereas, based on my experience, apart from how great the result is, I was struggled to make the settings right and sometimes miss the tour guide explanation about the place. In short, the camera didn't symbolize me. So, who am I? The diversity of Canon camera services or the third order becomes actualized for the user only if the product's technology boasts its strength in taking a picture and, combined with the image of Canon, conveys the impression of personal touch crafted for the user's tailored experiences. The thoughtful design of EOS M3 is the combination of achieving aesthetic and convenience for the, other, for the users. A stainless steel material makes it look sturdy, and this camera design with a touch of ergonomic non-slip grip that addresses an approachable and com comfortable concept. When reflecting the object order, the M3 came in a package with an 18 to 55 mm lens for general use. As long as we have the adapter, the lens is interchangeable with the array of the lens category to fit different purposes. The function delivers an image of a flexible personality like myself. On the other hand, the built-in flashlight feature is attractive. When the user needs more brightness, we simply push this button. It jumps out method was adapted from the identical concept with Jake in the box. From this aspect, I perceive the camera's sweetie personality and easygoing. This is the flashlight feature that caught me. The third order became a magnet that bridges the process of image and object. To be exact, the Canon and its user, later on, expand in a broader horizon when human, their culture, and community are involved. The culture man by Buchanan is the activity of ordering, disordering, and reordering in the search for understanding and for values which guide action. When discussing my relationship with the M3, the initial purpose was to travel with an automatic, less complex camera. Yet, the existence of M3 has grown into me. Now, I feel passionate to understand the M3 better. I became a smart traveler and maintained the core value of travel photography. Through reflecting on the placement, we can rediscover the new relationships between the signs, things, action, and thoughts. It has created a vehicle, a medium, tool to shape a user identity and naturally assign the user to the middle of the ecosystem. Canon cultivates its social media communities very well. The user do not just buy and own the product, but also involve in the community and culture. Possessing a Canon camera has relocated me into a particular identity. I have many chances to participate in many types of human interactions for many goals too. For example, to share my efforts, appreciate others' works, learn new techniques, or hear an inspiring journey. Also, I can play several roles, such as a collector type of traveler or a Canon camera enthusiast. However, owning the EOS M3 was not necessarily combat the problem. According to Doors and Cross, 
A solution to a problem is not a fixed answer, and one action will always lead to another situation. The initial trouble has tackled, however, does the process stop there? No, it uncovered a deeper problem that I should have acknowledged in the first place. The next issue was about the battery and protection. It is a habit that preparing the extra in advance has always been my top priority. Therefore, I need an extra battery and extra protection for my M3. Voila! I decided to purchase an extra battery, a lens protector, and a body jacket. It is to distinguish my M3 from the other M3. My friend also gave me a personalized strap. With that being said, I was engaged in the co-evolution process. Whenever a new situation showed up, I need to search for the relevant information only to find a new understanding. The M3 camera's character as a whole transformed to be a powerful companion from my novel perspective. After reflecting much about the placement, I can discover how my experience has transformed and will continue progressing. Now, this appearance is how my Canon EOS M3 should be look like. By adding the attributes to this object, redefine who I truly am and what my values are. Having Canon EOS M3 has positioned me from a mere traveler to a smart traveler. From can you help me to take a photo to let me take a photo of you. Meanwhile, the meaning of the object has shifted from a just EOS M3 camera becomes my extended eyes that focalize who I am. If I may, I interpret the placement process by analogy with an onion. The more I peel the layer, the more questions emerge, the more understanding perceived. Recollecting the new understanding is also influenced by the background of the observant. The four orders meaning embodied in this camera. Thus, it allows me to appreciate every angle of this camera and I am excited to explore all those faces behind the lens. It expresses my inner feeling about life that I could never explain in words. These are all about my identity quest, forming who I am and revealing the meaning of my life. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.